Today, we will demonstrate how to start up an HVAC drive using a Square D ATV 212 5 horsepower variable frequency drive. We will show you how to wire power terminals and do setup to run in local control. First, open the panel using a screwdriver and connect the incoming line power. For demonstration purposes, the line power is going to be single phase. Now, we will connect the motor. It must have all three phases connected for it to operate correctly. The variable frequency drive does make three phase power with single phase applied. Now the three phase motor and the single phase power is connected. Close the lid, lock it down and plug it in. Once power is connected and applied, the drive will display a hello message and then run mode will be visible. The display will be lit up and showing 0.0 Hertz. We will then start setting up our motor parameters. Press mode and then enter to access the quick menu. Use the up and down arrows to navigate to the motor control mode selector. Your display should read PE to indicate that you are in the correct menu. Now use the arrow keys to select your motor control mode and select the mode button to return to the quick menu. To change the values within a parameter, use the up and down arrows to set them at your desired amount and hit enter. The display will blink when the value is set. Follow this same process to set up the other parameters included in your quick access start guide. Three of these parameters are nominal motor voltage, nominal motor current, and nominal motor speed, and are listed on your motor's nameplate. Once your motor parameters are set, navigate back to the quick menu featuring the AUF code on your display. Now we must set our basic parameters. Once again, you will do so by using codes within the quick menu to review and change parameters if needed. When you have set the basic parameters listed in your quick start guide, use the mode button to return to the run mode screen. Your display should once again read 0.0 Hertz. Now we are ready to run a test of the motor. Make sure your device is in local mode by simply selecting the LOC button on your device. When that is selected, the LED light on the display will be on. The LED light between the arrows will be on for changing speed, and the LED above the run button will be on to indicate these functions are active. Now, when you hit the run button, you will hear the motor starting. It will immediately ramp up to the preset speed or a newly selected speed if you have changed it. To ramp the speed down, simply press the down arrow to your desired speed. Hit the enter button to save the new local speed command. Use the same process with the up arrow to increase speed. Hit the stop button to stop the motor. Hit run to return to the same speed. You have now successfully started up and conducted a test run of your HVAC drive. For more drive startup demonstrations and drive videos, stay tuned to GTV.